Oh Lord, when will my time come? I don't know how long I should keep looking for a job of my kind. The demand is too much. I am child of God. I don't fit these demands. Oh Lord, help me get a job of my kind. Sister, you can't believe this. I got a job. Are you serious? Of course I am. In fact not just any job, but a job that I have been waiting for. You can't imagine how happy I am today. But sister how? Finding a job as a lady in this town is absolutely impossible. How were you able to make it possible? Tell me sister I need a job too. You know what? Let me sit down. Did you say finding a job in this town is impossible? I guess you didn't meet the right people, because if you do, you would not say it's impossible. Tell me sister, what did you actually do to get your job? It's just simple, use what you have and you will get your job. In fact, when they said it, I didn't waste time about it, I gave it to them and I had my job. What do you mean by that? Are you not a smart girl? Come on, I don't have to explain this to you, because even a child would understand this. Let me go inside and freshen up, I am really tired. Does she mean by I should use what I have? What is she trying to say? Does she mean I should take money with me? If they are asking for money, then it's better I stay here, because I don't have anything on me to give them. Wait, I am going to look for money and they ask me money while they know I am going to work for money. No, I don't think this is what it means or what is she trying to say? I don't get it. Anyway, if I understand it or I do not understand it, what matters is to get the job. Besides, she said it's easy getting a job over there. Let me get dressed and go there right now. Are you not Sicilian's sister? Yes, I am, sir. I guess you're a job interview too? Yes, sir. See, let me tell you something, fine lady. Do you know you are beautiful? Have you had someone telling you that you are beautiful before? See, beautiful girls like you aren't supposed to be looking for a job. You don't have to be walking in this hot sun looking for a job. You are too beautiful for that. All you have to do is to use what you have and the job will be yours. Sir, I do not understand what you mean. Can you please let me understand? Oh, didn't your sister explain it to you? No problem. It is nothing difficult. Just spend a night with me and the job will be yours. Do you not know that your bodies are the members of Christ? Shall I then take the members of Christ? and make them the members of a harlot? God forbid. What? Do you not know that he which is joined to an harlot is one body? For two, says he, shall be one flesh. But he that is joined unto the Lord is one spirit. Flee fornication. Every sin that a man does is without the body. But he that cometh fornication sinneth against his own body. What? Do you not know that your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost which is in you, which you have of God, and you are not your own? For ye are bought with a price, therefore glorify God in your body, and in your spirit, which are God's. 1 Corinthians verse 15 to 20 I cannot do such a thing. My body is a temple of God and must be kept holy. See, forget about your what you are saying. This thing I am telling you right now, I don't say it and repeat myself. Every girl working in this company did the same, including your sister. In fact, they were even the ones that begged for it, but in your own case I am considering you because I like you, I know you like it, I don't know why you're doing this. How can your sister like it, you will not it? Come on. I am not like other girls, besides I am not like my sister. I am a holy nation, that I should chew forth the praises of him who hath called me out of darkness into his marvelous light. 1 Peter 2 verse 9 And he said to me, Now therefore, if you will obey my voice indeed, and keep my covenant, then you shall be a peculiar treasure unto me above all people, for all the earth is mine. Be not deceived, neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate, nor abusers of themselves with mankind, nor thieves, nor covetous, nor drunkards, nor revilers, nor extortioners, shall inherit the kingdom of God. Did you know that? Get out of my office and don't ever show your face here again. I should get out? No, stand there. I said, get out of my office. 
I don't need you here, besides you don't deserve my company, leave my office with that your holy things, they are smiling bad in my face. What a bad day. You should be happy that I even noticed you. Other girls will jump at the offer, and you are telling me nonsense. Let's see how long you will keep up without your holy attitude, in this current world that is give and take. You want others to help you but you don't want to help me. Nonsense. For whoever wants to save his life will lose it, but whoever loses his life for my sake will find it. What will it profit a man if he gains the whole world yet forfeits his soul? Or what can a man give in exchange for his soul? Matthew 16 verse 25 to 26 I rather remain jobless than have my soul destroyed. I will still stand to my faith. Sister can I ask you something? Yes, you're my sister. You can ask me any questions you like. Sister, did you sleep with them? Me, sleep with them. I will never do that. They just gave me the job. In fact, they didn't even ask me many questions, let alone ask me to sleep with them. You are lucky my sister. What about yours? How did it go? The man is just asking me to sleep with him, and you know I can never do that. And he refuses to give me the job unless I sleep with him. Oh no, let not that worry you, you will find another place. Don't worry, everything will be fine, sir. You sent for me. Are you sure she is your sister? I don't think both of you share the same blood. This girl is someone I don't understand. What has she done? Can you imagine she confidently told me that she cannot do it? What pains me most is, if that is the only way to get into this company, then she will remain jobless forever. Can you imagine this nonsense? The worst part is the preaching. Did I say I am lacking words of God or something? She almost spoiled my day. She was lucky I was in good mood on that day. I am sorry her attitude towards you. You know what? Let's go inside and do it again. I am feeling hot now. You are the one that is looking for a job. Yes, sir. If you want me to employ you here, bring $5,000 or no job for you. Sir, I don't have money. That is why I am looking for a job. If I had money, I wouldn't be looking for a job. Sir, please help me. I really need this job. No problem. That's okay. I will help you, I agree. You don't have money. Then let's do it this way. You will be sharing my bed with me for three days. How about that? This is easy for you. Answer me. Time is not on my side. I have a meeting with my colleague. I can't sell my soul for just a job. What are you trying to tell me? Sir. With all due respect, I cannot do it. Please use the door. I don't want to see your face. Nonsense. Sometimes I don't know why the people in this world are so wicked. If I happen to be his daughter, will he be happy to see me sleeping with a man old enough to be my father? Why will it have to be give and take? Is my set not working again? Hello, young lady. Are you not the one that motivated and inspired me with words of God, some years ago? If I am not mistaken, you go by the name Vivian. Yes I am. I am happy we have met again. In fact, you changed my life. I used to be a wayward mother until God used you to touch my life. Today I am a new creature. Everything in my life and the life of my family has become new. Thank God for that. You're welcome, Ma. Are you still leaving in the same street? Yes, I am. I can see you look tired. I don't want to stress you again. You can be going now. Okay, goodbye. She is the one my son will marry. With her, my son's company is secured. This type of girls are not easy to be seeing. I thank God that she is still living in the same street, then it will be so hard, if I am to look for her. My worry is over. She is exactly the kind of woman I want for my son. A woman that can take care of my son's wealth. Once my son comes back from abroad, I will bring him to her. I have won a lot of souls to God. What is so good to me? Guess what? I just got a promotion. Just like that, you have just started working. In fact, I am surprised as well. 
This favor of God is all over me. I don't know why God likes to bless me, even though I am a sinner. I am so grateful. Don't worry, God will remember you. You are his servant, after all. Oh no. Let me take some glass of water for you, you look so tired. Why am I not lucky? I am praying all the time. Doing fasting as well. Not that I'm not praying. I make sure I never disobey God's word. Yet I have no favor from God. Lord are you not seeing me? But look at my sister Cecilia. She lives her life the way she wants. She dress like the way she wants to dress. She doesn't even pray nor live to glorify God, but she succeeds in everything. It a crime to know God? Is it a crime to live a holy life? I am beginning to wonder. I no longer understand it all. Is this how I am going to remain all my life? Should I compromise to get a good life? But I have gone far. I don't want my soul to be destroyed. I will still keep it myself, I know God is seeing my tears and worries. Sister, I am going to see if today will be my day. Okay, take care of yourself. Okay, I will. My phone. Hello, sir. I am waiting for you at the hotel room. Why are you not there? But sir, we agreed on three nights. And I have spent the last three nights with you. The five nights ended three days ago, and I still gave an extra night yesterday. Why are you calling me for another one? Listen, I don't care what we agreed on, but you will continue to give it to me until I say I am tired. If not, you will lose the job. Now start coming. I don't want to wait for you any longer. You know the location, I want to see you there now. This man thinks, I am a fool. I will show him I'm not a fool. I know what to do, wise when someone wants to take me as fool. What is it, my daughter? There is this man that takes me for a fool. He and I agreed that I would share his bed with him for three days, and then he would give me a job. Now after the three day has been completed, he changed and said I must continue sharing his bed otherwise no job for me. Okay I hear you, what do you want me to do for you? I want you to make him marry me. Since he likes me in bed, he should like me in marriage. I don't care if he's married or not. I just want him to see me at his place all the time. Your request is granted my daughter. I will give you something to wash your face before meeting him. Once you meet him, even if he has a wife, he will reject her and marry you. But remember, you must make sure you wash it on your face and meet him every three days. Otherwise, he'll regain himself and send you away. When that happens do not blame us. No problem wise one. I'll make sure of that. Thank you. My son is back. My son, guess what? I have found a perfect match for you. This lady is so wonderful. She is the one that changed my life. With her, you have a wife. She is someone that can handle your wealth. Wow, I can't wait to see this woman that makes my mother happy. But mom, you know the kind of a woman I want. I have suffered a lot at the hands of women, so I want a true child of God. Son. Don't you trust your mother again? This woman is everything you need. When you see her, you will confirm it. Take me to her, mother. I want to bring her home as a wife. As long as you like her, I'll like her too. Let's go there. Don't worry, tomorrow we will go there. It is already late, go in and have a rest. All right, mother. Don't worry son, we will soon be there. It is not that far. No problem. Mother, I am okay. I am ashamed of myself and very disappointed. God is that how you are? Anyone who worship you does not go forward. Will the person turn out to be a failure? If that is the case, no problem. I can't believe I am still like this. I am beginning to be ashamed of myself. It looks as if I am lying to be a child of God. God. 
Who knows how happy Cecilia is now in her husband's house? I am so ashamed to be called a child of God. I regret it. I regret living a holy life. I wish I had lived my life the way Cecilia is living hers. Look at her rejoicing day by day, while I remain the way I am. It will end today. Everything called holiness will end today. I am going to join Cecilia and enjoy my life since being a child of God is all about suffering. I don't want to suffer. I believe this cannot work for me. I have held on to my faith for almost two years, yet nothing seems to be working out for me. I need to change my life. This life will not help me. I need to start wearing sweet dresses outside and live a happy life like my sister Cecilia. In fact, let me not be wasting time. I should get dressed and start now. Maybe someone will notice me and change my life for me. Wow, I think I look good in the mirror. I'm ready to go. Who is over there? Just wait for me. I am coming. We are already there. She will be inside. She will be here right now. Ardima. Yes. What do you want? I have somewhere to go. Are you not Vivian, the girl that met me the other day? Of course, I am the one. Mother please I am going back to where I packed my car when you are done come and meet me there. What is going on here? You have disappointed me. You have made me a liar. What have I done ma? What have you done? Do you know that man that left here? He is my son, the CEO of Barclays. I brought him to marry you. You disappointed me. How can you turn your back on God? What? I wonder why humans like running faster than God. Why can't they have patience? I wonder why we put material things first when worshipping God. Why is it that we worship God because of his blessings? Once there is a little delay, we turn our back on God. Even if he did not bless us on earth. What blessing is bigger than heaven, where Jesus has prepared for you? I thought that we worship God just to make heaven, but I am wrong. We are worshiping God just for earthly blessings. That is why we turn back on God once there is a delay. We are no longer remembering heaven, and the blessing that is waiting for us there. All that matters to us is earthly achievement. That is so disappointing. Oh no, what have I done? Why did I turn my back on God because of earthly blessings? If the only reason I worship God is to receive his blessings, I am a liar. Vivian I am finished. God forbid, God forbid this dream I have had. Oh Lord, I will keep on to your faith no matter what. Nothing will let me change my mind just to look for a job or a husband. I don't understand, ever since my sister left me alone to her husband's house, I have been having bad dreams all the time. Oh God, if you will not give me a job, why not a husband? I am now getting older, let me see your favor God. Ever since, our parents left us in the house, Cecilia has been the one living enjoying the good life, and I am the one living enjoying the bad life. Oh God why? I am in trouble if he delays any longer. It was getting late and the wise one said it must be every three days. Oh no, I'm beginning to regret why I went this far. I am afraid each day he might regain himself. There is no peace for the wicked indeed. I wish I could live a good life and allow God to bless me. His blessing is very peaceful. His blessing doesn't give one sleepless night or a headache. Like the one I'm facing all the time. In fact, let me go and look for him. I must meet him with the charm on my face by today. I need this man to come back and let me renew my charm. I can't afford to be disgraced. Oh no, my fake life is about to end. It is already getting late. What do I do? What do I do? I am finished. What should I do now? My fake life is about to end. Why didn't I give my life to Jesus and live a good life like Vivian? Now I am about to be disgraced. My son, guess what? I have found a perfect match for you. This lady is so wonderful. 
She is the one that changed my life. With her, you have a wife. She is someone that can handle your wealth. Wow, I can't wait to see this woman that makes my mother happy. But mom, you know the kind of a woman I want. I have suffered a lot at the hands of women, so I want a true child of God. Son, don't you trust your mother again? This woman is everything you need. When you see her, you will confirm it. Take me to her, mother. I want to bring her home as a wife. As long as you like her, I like her too. Let's go there. Don't worry, tomorrow we will go there. It is already late, go in and have a rest. Don't worry son, we will soon be there. It is not that far. All right mom, darling, I am home. Don't be offended. We finished our meeting very late yesterday, so I slept in a hotel. Dear welcome, I don't mind. Who's your dear? What are you doing in my house? And where's my wife? I am your wife. Whose wife? God forbid, where's my wife? Answer me. You married me. Shut up and get out of my house. A prostitute can never be my wife. Get out before I call the police. I will, I will. Where do I go from here? I have disgraced myself. There is no gain in bad living. I am completely finished. She is inside. She will be coming soon. Okay, no problem. I am here, Ma. Wow, what a beautiful. She's too beautiful. Mom, can I see you for a minute? Mother, are you sure this is the girl you were talking about? What it is, son? She is absolutely the kind of girl I wanted. Mother, you know what? Let me speak with her. Son, don't rush. She is all yours already. Okay, fine. Let me go back to my car and wait for you there. You well done, my daughter. You did not disappoint me. In fact, let me make everything short. Do you know that man that left here? He is my son, the CEO of Barclays. He is here to ask your hand in marriage. He wants to marry you, but he said he wanted to see your face. Guess what? When he saw your face, he couldn't stand it. What? Your son wanted to marry me? Oh God, thank you, thank you so much God. I never thought you had this plan for me. We will be coming for the second time to do the needful. No problem Ma, I am ever ready Ma. Then I will be going. Yay, e I, I'm finished Vivian. Please, I want to give my life to Jesus. What happened? What are you doing here crying? You should be in your husband's house. I don't have a husband. Everything was fake. The charm I am using has expired, and the man sent me away. You mean all this while you are using a charm? Yes, and he is the man that caused it. We agreed that he will give me a job after sleeping with him for three night, but instead of the man to keep to his promise, he changed and forced me to be sleeping with him any time he wanted, or I lose my job, so I became angry, and went to native doctor to make him marry me, and send his wife away but I regret it because he has regained his self. As I am talking to you now, I don't have a job and I don't have a husband either. Everything about me is fake. Please help me. I want to surrender my life to Jesus. There is no road to living a sinful life. I am now nobody. Oh my God, I thank God I was strong enough on my faith. I thank God Cecilia's lifestyle never got me attention, but I remained holy and faithful to God. See who is coming to ask my hands in marriage? A man who has everything I needed in life. Job, money, name it. Thank you God for making my tears and worries fade away.